It's September, the air's a little cooler, the sun is a little less hot, in the morning anyway, and you're just itching to break out the corduroys and maybe even jack-o'-lanterns. But if you switch on the TV, radio, or pick up a newspaper, you'll be greeted with... Higher education is facing a student mental health crisis. That's the, the case sparked conversation around student mental you health. Welcome to Campus Life today. in Canada today. This is one of the things that you hear about, that there's a mental health crisis. New this morning, a survey from Gallup shows an alarming increase in mental health struggles among college students. The report released over... Autumn, you see, is not all pumpkin spice lattes. It's also about sensationalized reports on the supposed mental health crisis in universities. You thought you, or your almost grown children or nieces or nephews, were embarking on a fresh and exciting new turn in life, maybe even engaging in a privilege of which your parents or grandparents could only dream. But no, you'd be wrong. Scroll the news and you'll find stories of rising rates of depression, anxiety, and even suicide on university campuses. Unique opportunities like going to university or college, making new friends, are actually daunting challenges that are quite likely to imperil your mental health. But what if none of this is true? What if the student mental health crisis is a myth? Visit patreon.com slash Ashley A. Frawley.